A city councilman has filed a lawsuit against the Hidalgo city manager, claiming the city is unfairly restricting the freedom to campaign outside Hidalgo's only polling place. That's City Hall. CBS 4's Imelda Mejia has more. Let's take a moment to see and hear what it's like right now at Hidalgo City Hall. Pretty peaceful, right? Well, the city manager says that's only possible if political signs and tents are kept away from the entrance to City Hall. Drivers see them as they make their way down a busy street. Political signs and yards on cars and just about everywhere you look. Everywhere except in one place. It's abuse of power. This is what City Hall looked like during the May elections. After the city manager issued an administrative order denying campaign signs from being posted at City Hall, this is what it looks like now. City manager Julian Gonzalez denies the allegations made against him and says his actions were done with safety in mind. Enormous signs uh, where we've had mass, massive destruction to our electrical lines and to our water system. Uh, costing the taxpayers uh, money to, to do the repairs because we have to come back and do all those repairs. But Rudy Franz, Hidalgo City Councilman and an active electioneer with the political organization concerned citizens of the City of Hidalgo Committee sees it differently. It's brought out um, more people. It's brought out more voters the way we did it before. Right now, as you can see, it's a very low turnout for the same reason you got to have action in order for people to get excited. And it, that goes against the presidency. It goes against everything that we believe in. Now Franz has filed a lawsuit against the city manager, claiming that he is interfering with his and his political organization's First Amendment right to engage in political activity by ordering the removal of tents and political signs from the front lawn of City Hall. We feel we're doing it fairly. It's across the board for everyone. Uh, our citizens have given us numerous uh, comments regarding that they feel a lot more at ease coming to City Hall to conduct day-to-day -day business. Gonzalez has been working on passing an ordinance that designates a specific area for political campaigning. But after three attempts and no quorum to be able to take action, he declared the front lawn to be sign and tent free, forcing political activity into the parking lots of City Hall. The temporary restraining order is currently pending review by the 398th District Court Judge Aida Salinas. In Hidalgo, Imelda Mejia, CBS4 News and TheValleyCentral.com.